doing? When I'm leaving your house, or when we are leaving the venue we went to, please pack it, wrap it inside bag for me and say, oh, baby girl, you've been wearing this stuff too much, and I think you should have a change. Okay. So what's your name and where are you from? I have a feeling you're the one. Feeling you're the I may be right. Hi, beautiful people. My name is Tammy Hess, your girl. You guys know what's up. You need to get already. <laughs> this video is gonna be like I'm gonna we're we'll going to be chatting, we're gonna be having conversations. Let me know what you guys think about this video in the comment section because I want us to interact. I want you guys to tell me things because I'm adding to the title. You guys already know what this stuff is all about. Things we need to put in the garbage. Like we need to dump them in the garbage this year. It should not go with us in 2019. For real, for real, you know. Like it should not come with us. And because I don't want to take too much of your time and you know, let's get started. Okay. I actually consulted a friend and I'm like, you know what, baby girl, like just give your girl some hints because I I typed some hints down and I'm like you know what? I can ask people like two heads are better than one, right? It shouldn't be only my idea, like okay, yeah, let me talk to other people about it. And I actually spoke to a few friends about it. But yeah, my friends came through for me and they gave me things that they don't want anymore in 2018. In 2019, so guys, dump it in the garbage for real. Let's start with this thing. Guys, see, stop. <laughs> Let's stop. Stop this new year, new me thing. There's no new you going anywhere. There's no new. 2019 will not make you new. Mm -mm. 2019 is a new calendar year for you to plan ahead for a better year. Not new you, new bullshit. Because you guys, you're not going to be new nothing. Come and beat me. I'm right here sitting down. Anyway, <laughs> like stop it. Every year, new you, new you. And nothing ever changes. Like you remain the same all year round. And even become more. You know? <laughs> So guys, stop it. Stop the new year, new year nonsense. Like, let it go. Let it go, let it go, let it go. <laughs> if people just see your friend, you be like, oh, you did not remember me. Did you remember me? Do you know if I'm existing? If I catch you. <laughs> if I catch you, you won't find it funny. Oh, did you remember me? Do you know if I'm existing? What do you mean by do I remember you? I don't remember you, girl. You remember me and I will remember you. You won't, you won't check up on your friend, you won't do anything. You're like, oh, you did not even remember me, you have forgotten me. Yes, I have things in my head. I'm, I'm looking for means to get better with myself, not you, baby girl. Like, if you remember me, I'm going to remember you. I'm going to remember ourselves. I'm relevant to each other. Like, do you know what I'm saying? So, yes, stop this. Do you remember me? I don't remember you. Oh, girl. Like, some people, for real, guys, like, Nobody owes you anything. This entire entitlement feeling, you guys should stop feeling. Stop feeling entitled. People are working their hearts up just to be better people every day. Thinking, looking for different ideas to be better and everything. And you're just sitting somewhere and thinking that your friend is just going to pop up some money to you or give you some things. Stop feeling entitled. Like nobody owes you no dime. Nobody. Your parents have tried for you. Trust me, how to hear in North America. Like, once you're in uni, parents send you out to go get a loan on your own for tuition. So you guys should be grateful to parents back in Africa because they see us through uni and their, themselves. Really, you guys should be grateful. So, like, stop this entitlement thing. And it's common with Nigerians, for real. And I, I don't know, but you guys should stop it. Nobody owes you anything, okay? Okay? Am I saying something to somebody? Before we go on, come on. Are you subscribed to this channel? Do you want to keep seeing this beautiful face? If you guys want to see a look on this makeup, let me know because I was just feeling really funky tonight and I'm like, you know what? Just create this beautiful Christmas look. It doesn't have to be all red all the time because, yes, it's a green and red season, so let's do something green and I like what I came up with. <laughs> Anyways, guys, yes, so stop feeling the title. That's gone. That's by the way. And there's this new thing. When you see people on the ground, when you see people on social media popping and all that, you don't know what it is about, you don't know what it is going for. And the next thing, when you see someone with new clothes, give me money. Stop it. That person needs money too. That person needs money. I'm serious. Guys, 
stop doing it. Stop doing it. Because people sometimes they feel bad when they cannot afford to give you what you're asking for. But they're really bad. Now you all know because once you know how you cannot give, you understand what I'm saying? So you know when you see people popping or wearing new clothes on, on the ground, apparently, automatically, they are rich. No, no sis. They are not. They're struggling just like you. <laughs> They're struggling just like you. So guys, like stop it. You should stop. Not everybody in 2019 knew you. You understand what I'm saying? There's a set of people I see on the ground every day. And the next the only thing I see is you don't you want to stop my shy, you don't want me to do this, you don't want me to grow. They hate you. They want to they want to pull you down. Your sex your success is affecting them. Your shine is too much for them, they need Google. They need goggles, Google glasses. People don't remember you like that. I'm serious. For real. Like people don't remember you. Like, they, they could go and go here. If you don't pop up on IG, maybe they see your picture. They don't know your existence. So stop it. Nobody, nobody eats you. They don't eat you. Probably you eat yourself and see you need to do something about it. Like nobody eats you. Stop it. Okay? Okay? Stop this eta, this eta that. Nobody's eating you. I will not interested. Like, okay? Thank you. You waste 30 minutes of your life to open your fake account. And just to get blocked in two seconds. Like, stop it. Stop wasting your life. You could be better. You could do something beautiful with your life. You don't have to waste your life. Like, I am preaching to you, five people. You really don't have to waste your life. Like, what do you think? Creating a page for 30 minutes and getting it up in two seconds. Like, does that make any sense to you? You just, because you want to pop, you just want to write shit on people's accounts. Like, stop it. Stop trolling people. It makes people depressed. That's what people are not Stop trolling people. Stop making people feel bad about themselves. You're not better. Like, you're the same. Like, stop making people feel bad. People you cannot see and say shit to. Like, you, because you're behind your phone, you, you feel you could just tag nonsense. I'm less than three months on YouTube and I remember my first thing coming and I'm like, oh yeah, I'm ready for you guys. I've been, I've heard so much about you guys. I'm really ready for you. Like, bring it up. Like, it did not remove anything from my body. But there are some people that actually feel bad about all these things. So really, stop it. The next thing we want to talk about is... Motivational speakers doing on that one. just like me. <laughs> Motivational speakers doing on their way. I promise everything I've mentioned in this video, I'm going to hold on to it. This new year, although I don't believe really anything, but this new year, I'm going to hold on to it and I promise I'm not going to carry it along with me. It's going to stay back in 2018. So, motivational speakers doing on their way. I'm not going to mention names, but yes, you people, let it be going on in your mind like, oh yes, I know this so person, I know this person. So, whatever, but motivational speakers, I hope you get to see this sometimes soon. Doing otherwise, preaching to young girls, preaching to young adults, like this is how to do things, this is what to do and all of that. But you guys do otherwise, you see you and when you come out, you come and say another thing to us like, oh yeah, it wasn't supposed to happen like that, blah 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 blah. Stop it, okay? We don't want it to start in our that's the new ones. Do within your means. Do what you can afford. Don't cut your coat according to your size. Cut it according to your body shape. If you are a size 8, cut it according to your core. Nobody sees you. Because you just want... And, and, the, and the annoying thing now is that you guys are going to do all of those things just because you want to show for, you want to show the ground that oh yes, I'm popping and shit. And at the end of the day, they just give you one like and that's it, you're gone. You're gone. Gone, gone. So guys, stop it, really. People don't, people don't care that much about you. For real, or no, people don't care. Like, you don't care. They just want, they just want things to be in the news. They just want to see things to talk about. That's just it, nothing more. Okay, let's talk about inferiority content. I've been there. There's no, there's no lady that will say at some point in their life they've not had this inferiority complex or something. But if you haven't, but yes, I'm not going to, I'm not going to hide and say, okay, yes, I have not heaven. That's a lie. I've been dead. But you know what? I'm done. Nah, you're never going. Nobody's going to make me feel less of myself. I want something. I'm going for it. Immediately, I want something. I go for it. 
you know what? I'm not even here about what you're going to say. Say what you want to say. You know what you're going to say to your friends. You know where? In your house. You know, you know why? Because you guys can say it to me. So why should I feel bad that you people are saying things behind my back? Like, feel free. I'm ready, but that's why. That's why I'm in you people's. That's why I'm in you people's mind. That's why you guys are chatting about me. Like, continue, but really, guys, let's just stop. Stop feeling easy. Stop feeling insecure. Stop feeling. Stop having a priority complex. Stop feeling people are better than you. I have a lot of people that do it. Like they feel everybody's better than them. They feel people are going to talk bad about them and all these. They want people to chat shit about me. You like that chat? Chat, please. Do what you want to do. I, I, I'm serious, guys. This YouTube channel I wanted to start for a very, very long time. But because oh, what is, what's this person going to say? What, what are they going to think? Do I look good on camera? Can I talk well on the camera? Like, people who accept me, I will do it. Like, whatever I want to do, even if it's just five, ten people that are going to watch me, that's okay. Like, as long as it makes me happy, I don't go out of my comfort zone to do it. Like, just do you. Do you. They are going to chat regardless. Everybody's going to say whatever they want to say. Regardless. Oh, the last thing I want to talk about, guys, is please, who said we have to wear one clothes on this? Why? <laughs> Who borrowed you money to buy it? <laughs> who borrowed you money to buy it? Me! Who said we have to work two months? Why? For real though, I have been there. I'm not going to do it again. If I have this job, this, this follow, I'm going to rock it and you people will know that. Okay, that's the same company. As long as it makes me happy, as long as I like it that much. Because there was one time in my life that I'm like, oh yeah, I won't disclose, I'm not going to wear it to that place again because they see me wear it. I will wear it though. If you are angry, when I'm leaving your house or when we are leaving the venue we went to, please to pack it, wrap it inside bag for me and say, oh, baby girl, you've been wearing this stuff too much and I think you should have a change, okay? So please, let's stop it. Nobody said we should wear clothes more. Please, let's, let us stop it, okay? And yes, that's everything I want to talk about for 2018. I hope I see you all in 2019 and I hope you see me too. Anyway, I hope you guys have a beautiful year and share this video with your friend and share it with your editor. <laughs> Share this video with your friend, with your editor. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. And if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Besides, I like the video. Like, I'm feeling myself in this video. I look so good. Like, you know. <laughs> Alright, people. I'll see you in my next video. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year in advance. Mm -hmm.